Pritilada Watadar the 5th of May 1911 to the 23rd of September 1932 was a Bengali revolutionary nationalist from the Indian subcontinent who was influential in the Indian independence movement After completing her education in Chittagong and Dhaka she attended Bethune College in Kolkata Pritilada graduated in philosophy with distinction After a brief stint as a school teacher Pritilada joined a revolutionary group headed by Surya Sen she led a team of 15 revolutionaries in 1932 attack on the Pahartali European Club, which had a sign board that read, Dogs and Indians not allowed. The revolutionaries torched the club and were later caught by the British police. To avoid arrest, Pritilata consumed cyanide and died. <laughs> Early life Pritilada was born in a middle-class Vaidya Brahmin Vaidya family on 5 May 1911 in Dalghat village in Patia Upazila of Chittagong now in Bangladesh. Wadadar was a title conferred to an ancestor of the family who originally had the surname Dasgupta. Her father Jagabandu Wadadar was a clerk in the Chittagong municipality. Her mother Pratibamayi Devi was a housewife. The couple had six children Madisduan, Pritilata, Kanaklata, Shantalata, Ashalata, and Santosh. Pritilata was nicknamed Rani. Jagabandhu tried to arrange best possible education for their children. He got Pritilata admitted in Dr. Kastagir Government Girls School of Chittagong. Pritilata was a meritorious student. A teacher in the school, whom students affectionately used called Usha D, used stories of Rani Lakshmibai to inspire nationalism in her students. Kalpana Dada, a classmate of Pritilata, writes in the biography Chittagong Armory Raiders, We had no clear idea in our school days about our future. Then the Rani of Jhansi fired our imagination with her example. Sometimes we used to think of ourselves as fearless. Arts and literature were Pritilata's favorite subjects. She passed out of Dr. Kastagir Government Girls School in 1928 and in 1929, got admitted to the Eden College, Dhaka. In the intermediate examinations, she stood first among all students who appeared in that year's examination from the Dhaka board. As a student in Eden College, she participated in various social activities. She joined the group Shri Sangha, headed by Leela Nag, under the banner Dipali Sangha, Dipali Sangha. In Calcutta To pursue higher education, Pritilata went to Calcutta now Kolkata and got admitted to the Bethune College. Two years later, she graduated in philosophy from the college with a distinction. However, her degree was withheld by British authorities at Calcutta University. In 2012, she and Bina Das were conferred their certificates of merit posthumously. As a school teacher After completing her education in Calcutta, Pritilata returned to Chittagong. In Chittagong, she took up the job of headmistress at a local English medium secondary school called Nandankanan Aparnacharan School. Revolutionary activities Joining Surya Sen's revolutionary group Pritilada decided to join the Indian independence movement. Surya Sen had heard about her and wanted her to join their revolutionary group. On 13 June 1932, Pritilada met Surya Sen and Nirmal Sen in their Dalghat camp. A contemporary revolutionary, Bainad Bihari Chowdhury, objected that they did not allow women to join their group. However, Pritilata was allowed to join the group because the revolutionaries reasoned that women transporting weapons would not attract as much suspicion as men. Inspiration from Ramkrishna Biswas Surya Sen and his revolutionary group decided to kill Mr. Craig, Inspector General of Chittagong. Ramakrishna Biswas and Kalapada Chakravarti were assigned for this task. But they mistakenly killed S.P. of Chandpur and Traini Mukherjee instead of Craig. Ramakrishna Biswas and Kalapada Chakravarti were arrested on 2 December 1931. 
After the trial Biswas was ordered to be hanged till death and Chakravarti to be exiled to cellular jail, the family and friends lacked the amount of money required to travel to Chittagong to Alipur jail of Calcutta. Since at that time Pritalada was staying in Kolkata, she was asked to go to Alipur jail and meet Ramkrishna Biswas. Topic activities in Surya Sen's group Along with the revolutionary group of Surya Sen, Pritalada took part in many raids like attacks on the telephone and telegraph offices and the capture of the reserve police line. In the Jalalabad battle, she took the responsibility to supply explosives to the revolutionaries. Pahartali European Club attack 1932. In 1932, Surya Sen planned to attack the Pahartali European Club which had a signboard that read, ''Dogs and Indians not allowed''. Surya Sen decided to appoint a woman leader for this mission. Kalpana Datta was arrested seven days before the event. Because of this, Pritalata was assigned the leadership of the attack. Pritalata went to Kotawali Seaside for arms training and made the plan of their attack there. They decided to attack the club on 23 September 1932. The members of the group were given potassium cyanide and were told to swallow it if they were caught. On the day of the attack, Pritalata dressed herself as a Punjabi male. Her associates Kalishankar Day, Bhareshwar Roy, Prafula Das, Shanti Chakraborty wore dhoti and shirt. Mahendra Chowdhury, Sushil Day and Panna Sen wore lungi and shirt. They reached the club at around 10.45 p.m. and launched their attack. There were around 40 people inside the club then. The revolutionaries divided themselves into three separate groups for the attack. In the club, a few police officers who had revolvers started shooting. Pritalada incurred a single bullet wound. According to the police report, in this attack, one woman with a surname of Sullivan died and four men and seven women were injured. <laughs> Death An injured Pritalada was trapped by the British police. She swallowed cyanide to avoid getting arrested. The next day, the police found her body and identified her. On searching her dead body, the police found a few leaflets, photograph of Ramkrishna Biswas, bullets, whistle and the draft of their plan of attack. During the post-mortem it was found that the bullet injury was not very serious and that cyanide poisoning was the cause of her death. The Chief Secretary of Bengal sent a report to British authorities in London. In the report it was written, Pritalada had been closely associated with, if not actually the mistress of, the freedom fighter Biswas who was hanged for the murder of Inspector Tarini Mukherjee, and some reports indicate that she was the wife of Nirmal Sen who was killed while attempting to evade arrest of Dalghat, where Captain Cameron fell. <laughs> Influence Bangladeshi writer Selina Hossein calls Pritalada an ideal for every woman. A trust named Burkanya Pritalada Trust, Brave Lady Pritalada Trust has been founded in her memory. Pritalada's birthday is celebrated by the trust in different places of Bangladesh and India every year. The trust considers her to be a beacon of light for women. The last end of Sahid Abdus Sabor Road to Makunda Ram Hat of Bolkali Upazila in Chittagong has been named as Pritalada Wadadar Road. In 2012, a bronze sculpture of Pritalata Wadadar was erected in front of the Pahartali Railway School, adjacent to the historical European club. Wadadar's great great niece is British journalist and academic, Ash Sarkar. <laughs> Legacy Pritalata Wadadar Mahaidyalaya, a college in Nadia district. Pritalata Shahid Manar Pritalada Hall, University of Chittagong Pritalada Hall, Jahangirnagar University Pritalada Wadadar Primary School, Chittagong Kanchara Pritalada Shiksha Nikitan Boys HS, Girls HS. And Primary Section, Three Schools, Gobardanga, West Bengal, India In popular media 2010 Bollywood movie Kalain Hum Ji Yan Se was based on Chittagong Uprising where Vishaka Singh played the character of Pritalada. In 2012, the Hindi film Chittagong was released based on the uprising. 
Vega Tamosha played the role of Wadadar. In 2018, Kiran Sonia Sawar delivered a monologue Wadadar in Pritalata, a short film in the BBC series, Snatches, Moments from Women's Lives, to mark the 100th anniversary of women's suffrage and as part of the Hear Her season. The film was written by Tanika Gupta. Gallery See also Kudaram Bose Jatindra Nath Das Myth of No Dogs or Chinese Allowed plaque in Shanghai No Dogs or Muslims poster in Algeria <laughs>